nearby officers, please proceed to the West Village. Alarmist. Paranormal. Conspiracy. All nasty words people have used to insult and demean me. But now, after years of me trying to warn you all, here we are. Spider-Man has literally brought a plague down upon us. Why do I blame him and not Martin Lee? I do blame Martin Lee. He deserves swift justice, but he's a lunatic terrorist. This is what they do. Whereas Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Yet, he obviously knew about the threat and didn't warn us. He either thought he'd handled it, which makes him criminally negligent, or he was in on it, which makes him a terrorist, too. Stop resisting! Got it. Sable units requesting status update for Little Tokyo. Observation post is live. You know, I don't mean to overreact, but I'm starting to take this personally. Well, they attacked me, but of course, I'm the criminal here. Prisoners are rioting in the streets. Mobilize at Dutchtown. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the Relief Center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? Exploding bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy. What the hell? Need to distract him. Hacking app should work. Must be hearing things. I might be able to hack that. to distract him. Better hurry. What's that? Hey. Nice. Should be able to hop that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. Dying. I'm a 
No antibiotics. I need to keep looking. More supplies over there. Schedules for supply. Need to get past these guys. I don't have that information. Believe me, I hate watching them play. It turns my stomach. Just give us the info and we'll stop. Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these relief centers? Something about Osborne. They want to show how weak he is, that he can't protect the city. <laughs> as long as they let us keep all the supplies we find, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on, let's keep digging through it. The Sable guys give up the depot locations? Eventually, yeah. Now the big guy's taking the stations out all by himself. Walk the I heard that! That Russian blood, man, makes him crazy. That's offensive. My grandma's Russian. Your grandma? Doesn't that mean you're Russian? Too? Another supply tent. Oh, crossing fingers. Looks like they're gonna divvy up the supplies. Oh boy. Better not try to short us. Hey, you guys better not try to short Couple us. Trauma kits, but no antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Bro, relax. Everybody gets a take. Nobody's trying to short you. That's what they say when they're trying to short you. Dude, please don't embarrass me. Chill, please. Nobody's I'm watching these jokers. Oh yeah, I'm watching them. Gotta avoid that sniper. Hey, who's there? What the hell? Supplies. Oh, come on, crate, be the one. Oh, Mox is selling. Perfect. That is a damn large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedules. Now! Just as out! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is. inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! Oh. Oh. Did not need to see that. is right past them. Yeah. 
Wait for it. Oh! oh. No. my exit. Yeah! 
Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to peace. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. <laughs> Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby. Yuri, Rhino's targeting Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. <sighs> I'll catch him later. occupying army but let's hear it from the caller go ahead they won't let me in my building said it's boring i said fine let me in and i'll stay there they pointed their guns at me ran me off like a criminal i got no place to go caller this is deeply disturbing No one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Ah! Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Ah! Means that all of life is being the 
Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Gargan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. We 
murdered Spider-Man and used his corpse for a blanket. Hey! Gargan, please! You embarrass yourself! No! Scorpion! Gargan has no principle. He fights for profit. Untrue. I rip Spider-Man face off for free. The money's the bonus. Now, you know, I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! Rhino stunt. Time for fist to fear. Come here, Hulk. I will teach you to throw a real punch. Know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer.
That's all of them. Let's find out what they were up to. Captain, these Sable guys look like they forced all the residents out of a building so they could occupy it themselves. And locked up the ones who objected. Okay, that I can get something done about. But I need victims to come forward. I'll get the people out and have them file reports with the police. So, when you were little, did you say, I'm gonna grow up and be a fascist oppressor? Yeah, you probably did. like not to have anywhere to stay. It's a good thing these stable agents have body armor, because I just might lose my temper.
know, for private security, you guys aren't very private. Drama. For what? People that were locked up are headed back to their homes. Good. And I finally convinced the mayor's office that making constituents homeless was not good for his poll number, so they won't be pulling that stun again. Hey, I'm back. What were we talking about? Oh yeah, I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay, Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room, but that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction.
every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. important as Osborne. This isn't fair. Let us back upstairs. Off limits, ma'am. <sighs> Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. <laughs> Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back Security upstairs. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. More like Osborne's safety. Please, everyone. Hello. Swear your way out of here. I know a few Sable agents who would okay. love to meet you. Turn him around. Alpha team, stay alert. Got movement, stand by. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. 
What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Hmm, schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. The fabulous Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left like Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms. And a motto, Pax in Bello, Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in Mace. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days.
Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. This is kinda cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Said Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. <laughs>